Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. So today is Sunday. I went to church on Sunday and this is an impromptu video. I just decided to do it. Now, every Sunday we have a snack. After going to church, you know, I went to church in the morning and we had a wonderful time. So we came back. One thing we do in my house every Sunday, we have a snack, especially after church. Now these snacks can range anywhere from fruit, fruit juices, cakes, cookies, healthy stuff, even plantains, which is what we're having today. So we bought the plantains yesterday and we decided we're going to make it after church for our snack. What we usually do when we're having our snack is we talk, we, you know, we're browsing online and we're cooking and we're also eating. I already washed my plantain and now I'm going to start slicing it up. I'm using the slanted method to cut my plantains. I have a nice video on that. I'll leave it linked in the comment section. You can check it out. Different ways to cut plantain. So church was great today. Um, next week Sunday actually might be a little bit more hectic because we have Youth Sunday and Youth Sunday is where the youth actually lead the whole service from the preaching and sometimes the praise and worship to you know either acting drama singing songs etc after church we have Bible study that's in the evenings and today the Bible study leader couldn't come so I had to lead it and the topic was basically returning to your first love was quite an interesting topic we had a nice discussion so i'm done slicing up my plantains i'm going to throw my plantain peels into my little farm or my garden they're like banana peels and they're like a good fertilizer then i'm going to add some salt and thoroughly mix my plantains now it's time to fry now i'm going to add some oil to my saucepan and leave it to heat up for about two to three minutes back to the bible study discussion one thing i really learned was the need to stay consistent and focused and determined in everything you do especially in your relationship with God. After like two minutes or so, what I usually do is put in one plantain to see if the oil is hot enough. If it is, then I add the rest. Now guys, there's something I've noticed. When the plantain is scooped together in like one big chunk and added to the oil, it usually tends to stick together. However, if I add in the plantain one by one like I'm doing now, they tend not to stick together or at least they don't stick together as much. So you have your single plantain. I don't know, what's your experience? Or is it just a me thing? So I'm just going to let my plantain fry. I'm going to allow it to brown on one side, then flip it over, let it brown on the other side. It doesn't take long. Besides, it smells amazing. And within a few minutes, my plantain is ready. I'm going to pack it up into my sieve, and then I'm going to fry the next batch. Anyway, guys, I wanted to ask, what type of plantain fryers are you? Are you the type that, you know, eat your plantain while you're frying them? You know, eat almost half of it before you get to the table? Or you're the type... That is able to fry everything, keep everything intact, and bring it all to the table. Let me know in the comment section. Personally, I'm one to taste my plantains. Taste in quotes. I taste my plantains while I fry them. Um, so what I bring to the table is quite different from what I fried. As you can see. <laughs> in truth though, I did share some of the plantain with my family. So I don't think I'm that bad. I paired my plantain with some tomato sauce. And I'm also going to wash it down with some green tea. And since we're staying healthy, I'm going to be adding some dates powder. Looks more like dates granola. But anyway, it was nice. So I had a fantastic snack and I loved it. You can watch me eat. <laughs> so my friends, thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for spending your Sunday with me. Also, don't forget to check out my video on the different ways to cut plantain. I'll leave it linked in the comment section. Also, leave your thoughts and questions in the comment section if you have any. And I would like to know your thoughts on these type of videos if you like these type of videos. I would also like to know what type of plantain fryers you guys are and your experience with frying plantains. Also, don't forget to subscribe and share this video. It really helps. I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Ciao!